It's all of 13 years since Port Merion was bursting with straw hats and blazers as characters acted out a series of baffling plots. Yet the memory of Patrick McGowan's prisoner lives on, courtesy of the Six of One Club, the society of enthusiasts formed after the series was first shown. This weekend they were back, not just to hold a convention, but to make their own 40-minute prisoner film. But what is the magic of a series that's achieved wide acclaim in America as well as Britain? Well, I think if we could answer that definitively, these people would not be here. A lot of them have come to discover what that magic is for themselves. There is something about the series that is special to a lot of people. Either they identify with the character that McGowan plays, they identify with this place, Port Merion, or they identify with the themes that the th series expresses, one man in isolation in contemporary society. It's been some years since it's been on in British television, but are you still getting more members joining it? Oh yes, uh, all the time there are people uh, responding to articles or interviews they hear about us. Uh, particularly now from America, where it's still being rescreened because there are more TV stations there. They're picking up uh, imported British sci-fi mags, which uh, publish something about us, and we're getting response internationally now. The human chess game that featured in one episode of The Prisoner will also be appearing in the club's film scripted, acted and directed by members. There's no leading role. Patrick McGowan now lives in America. He's never been to one of the club's conventions, but keeps in touch. His main memory seemed to be one of a lot of hard work. I think there was a very tough and tight shooting schedule, and McGowan himself was acting, editing, writing, executive producer, and towards the end, virtually a one-man band. A lot of hard work, he remembers. But fond memories? Oh, fond memories, yes. He said in no way is he ashamed of what he did. And um, I think he's proud that he created something on television which nobody else did before. I don't think anybody else has done since. Patrick McGowan may not have been there, but there was still a link with the past. Three of the original extras from Port Maddock turned up, but what memories particularly stood out? Well, I think the general chaos of the uh, <coughs> film work. It was quite an eye-opener for me. I'd never taken part in the film before that time, and uh, I was rather surprised that uh, well, a lot went on. The dedication of yeah. that uh, man to his work, and the Patrick McQueen himself. I mean, he wrote a lot of the script. He was up there, mm. and oh, we saw him come, and we just quiet and listened to it. It was a very weird series, though, wasn't it? Well, did, did, did you yourself take part? No, I don't mind admitting. Did you really? No, I, 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 do I understand that. more yes. now. No, I more I, now than ever at that, that yes. time. I need to see it a second time. Yeah. You know. Yes. Yeah. We but didn't we know what was going on at the time. No. Hello again. The clip you've just seen is a news item that Harlech TV, that's the Welsh TV channel. Uh, made of us filming by public demand in 1979. You remember that I spoke about this enterprise earlier. It was a very, very busy convention, 1979, and we were blessed weather-wise. And in addition to all the reporters that came up, Harlick sent this crew up to film us making by public demand. So I'll tell you a little bit about it. About 50 of us were involved, and it had its origins in a discussion we had the previous year and how we'd like to celebrate the prisoner and pay homage by making our very own film. Now, we had to work out a way of doing it. We didn't want to have a number six, and we wanted to have a number of characters. So four of the characters, the main players, actually wore tabards with the four card suits, club, heart, diamond, spades. Then, of course, there was a number two. And in addition to that, there was a film crew, a village film crew called Everyman. They all had a number, the same number, but were whatever the number was, A, B, C, and so on. So it was quite densely plotted, and there was uh, about 50 people all told involved. And the film director filmed it. We had uh, a mini moat chase. We had the election parade. We had the chess game. Lots went on. And 
it was a very intense weekend indeed. The film itself ran for about 45 to 50 minutes. Larry Hall took it, breathed magic onto it at one point and produced the finished product. The film itself, you're going to see a few clips of it, but I always think that it was a wonderful thing to do and it wasn't just us being passive. We were out there being positive. It was quite philosophical. It was densely plotted. It did have a lot going for it. So, prisoner fans, enjoy a few clips from the actual film itself. It's 16 mil and it's not good quality, but it will give you the flavor. Thank you. Following our last meeting about the dissident element in the village, it's necessary to create a diversion to expose the weaker elements, pin the blame on the worst offenders, and direct the community back onto the right path. First, we need a scapegoat. This is number 11. Reports indicate a definite unwillingness to integrate. He's been under constant surveillance, but still tries the occasional breakout. The Guardians have had to herd him back on more than one occasion. Good morning, good morning, and what a beautiful day for our election. Today we are choosing our new leader, and don't forget, this time, this time there are, are two, two candidates, candidates to choose, choose from. from. Remember, Remember, it's your vote that counts. That counts. In the time I have spent guiding our community, I have endeavoured to think carefully, act wisely and implement gently. I have sought to understand and counsel our more difficult and over inquisitive citizens. There have been those who have tried to turn the minds of the more easily led amongst us. I have always ensured that they have been removed before doing harm. Today is a very important day. For today, you will elect my successor. But before I go, we have a necessary matter to resolve. A matter of principle. Justice must be seen to be done. I promised the dissidents would be removed. Units. Orange alert. 
Queen's Knight Pawn to Queen 4. King's Knight to Queen 4. Queen's Knight to Queen Bishop 3. King's Pawn to Pawn 3. Queen's Bishop to Queen Knight 2. King's Bishop captures Black Hall.